stop what you're doing and hit the brakes because today we're checking out these incredible die-cast Marvel vehicles and metal figs paid for by Jada Toys. What's up, Marvelites? I'm Langston Belton. And I'm Nick Carrillo. And today we're here to show off some heavy metal. Some, some heavy metal figures from Jada Toys. No, seriously, they're actually made of metal and they're, uh, they're kinda heavy. Yeah, let's take a look. Okay, first up, we have the 124th scale 67 Mustang Shelby with a Star-Lord metal fig. And right out of the gate, this thing comes in some awesome packaging. I almost don't wanna tear into it. <laughs> he said it almost, so let me get at it. Lefty Lucy, right? Yeah, righty tighty lefty yeah, Lucy. Right yeah, you're doing right, huh? There, there we go. go. Well, Langston, I'm very glad that you convinced me to open this because th these are sick. These are amazing. They're incredible. I'm sorry, that's the only way I can uh, describe it. Um, first off, this uh, Star-Lord figure, that's mm -hmm. incredible. And he's in his iconic uniform. It's so detailed. They did so many little things. Look, he's got back pockets. They, did, they didn't need to do that, but they did for you and us, all of us. It's incredible. He's awesome looking. You really see up close the metallic shine they all have to it, like this die, the classic die cast metal look. You want to hold in the light and let it shine. Let it <laughs> Let, let it look good. Let it get that good shine yeah. on it, yeah. The colors are so vibrant and so good and so clear and succinct that it really does look like a collectible. It feels like a collectible. Yeah, if you want to make your whole life this collectible, this, you know, <laughs> Star-Lord, you can, and because these are already going together. And you know, you can put them on top, and you know, this vehicle has the Guardians of the Galaxy emblem on the side. It's got details all over. So you know, this is a vehicle of the galaxy. If you wanted more, don't worry, because we have plenty more. Next, we have the 132nd scale 1973 Ford Bronco with a Groot metal fig. Yes, and I really love the 132nd scale because you can easily put this on a desk or a bookshelf. In your hands, <laughs> wherever, wherever, wherever you display your displays, <laughs> exactly. Um, but, but even at this size, it still has this really cool functionality and detail. I mean, check out that paint job. We can check it out even better out of the box. Yes, please, mm -hmm. let's do. There we go. There All right. it is. And here comes that magic moment. Come on, oh. everyone's watching. Okay, here we have him, unboxed and looking good. This Ford Bronco styled after Groot with this gorgeous brown and white colorway. And what's really cool is that the Groot metal fig and vehicle both have this metallic brown paint detail. So they match, they look really great, and Groot, it's dancing Groot. He's in his little pot, and he's dancing, he's happy. He's got his Ford Bronco. You'd be happy too if you had a Ford Bronco with uh, your own logo, like Groot has, a Groot logo and tree decals. Yeah, and it says, I am Groot, because folks, this vehicle and this fig are gonna have you saying, I am Groot. And finally, we have these spectacular Spider-Man metal figs. Yeah, we got the big three, folks. We got Spider-Man, we got Miles Morales, and Ghost Spider, all in their classic Spidey poses. Mm -hmm. Yeah, who doesn't love doing Spidey poses? You have to when you're just, a kid. I do it now. I just, I'm just walking down the street and I just... Flipping about, yeah. Yeah, now, as you can see, these die-cast figures are an incredible collectible for any Spider-Fan. Oh yeah, Spider-Man, Spider-Fan. Two of that, 10 yeah. points, yeah. Well, ten let's point. get them out of the box, please. Yeah, please. Little spider surgery. Tear into it like it's Christmas Day. All right, I am super excited about these. They are so awesome, I'm a huge Spider-Man fan. Look how incredible these are. They're 100% die-cast in 2.5 inches, high quality, and they are heavy. They have a good weight yeah. to them. This is a great collectible. And you know me, I love toys. You do, this I This is so. definitely the type of thing I would collect. I would display on a shelf, on my desk, anywhere. Keep it in my pocket and you know, always remember Spider-Man. With great power, right? Yes, and of course, these are classic versions of the Spider-Man characters that you see here. And that die-cast metal sheen really helps the colors pop the red and blue of your Peter Parker, the black and red of the Miles Morales, the pink, white, and black of a ghost spider, Gwen Stacy. This is such a cool thing, and this is why I love die cast metal, because that sheen really pops. It catches the light, and what's cooler than a Spider-Man, but a metallic looking Spider-Man. <laughs> and what's even cooler is they're already in a Spider-Man pose to be showcased. They're all like dynamic, they look awesome. Each one is distinct to their character. You know that's Spider-Man, you know that's Miles Morales, you know this is Ghost Spider. They look incredible. I tell you again, I wanna, I wanna collect these. You can, you can, and guess what? Hey, you can collect them all, and this is just wave one. Wait, what? Yes, there will be a wave two. Oh, so I'm very excited, because yes. these are already incredible, so I can't wait to see what comes next. Yeah, look at these guys. This was an absolute blast. Thank you, Nick, for unboxing these with me. Oh, thank you for convincing me to unbox them. They were awesome. These are so incredible. 
It was so great to see them up close and to hold them. I can't wait to collect them. And you can check out all of these terrific toys and more at Amazon.com slash Jada Toys. Or click the link in the description. Yeah, well, I think nothing else to do but play around. Play yes. around with them. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, Lord, I am Groot. He's going to get out. I hope so. Yeah. Take him more. Thank you.